Did you know that Ali Abbat visited Shah Rukh Khan for a day? In an exclusive interview, Vavvi discusses the process of working with Karen, Ranveer Singh and Ali Abbat, paying odes to Yash Chopra and Sanjay Leela Bansali, and recreating Dola Re Dola with two male actors. Edited excerpts. Karen Johar has paid tributes to two filmmakers, Yash Chopra and Sanjay Leela Bansali, who we've worked with multiple times. How nostalgic was the experience of choreographing the songs in Rocky or Rani Ki Prem Kahani? I think he's paid homages to a lot of filmmakers, from Manmohan Desai to Raj Kapoor. Even Guru Dutt, whenever some melancholic music comes in. And of course, Yash Chopra. These are some of the stalwarts of Hindi cinema. Then of course, there's Sanjay, for his exuberance and drama. It's a love letter to Hindi cinema. We're from a generation where we've seen the golden era of Hindi cinema, like Raj Kapoor or Guru Dutt. I'm not sure if kids of today's generations are aware of Kagaz Kafol or Shri 420. We're that generation who've seen the best of both the worlds. Karen has always been a student of cinema, like me. It's very important to observe and learn from other filmmakers' craft, and even from their mistakes. If you noticed, there's no foreign location in Rocky or Rani Ki Prem Kahani, which is very unlike Karen Johar, laughs. He said, let's pay a tribute to Yash Uncle. Which director would want to pay a tribute to another director's work? Every director is here to prove their own mettle. But here's this ball of joy called Karen Joher who's trying to extend his love for those movies to his technicians, crew members, actors, and eventually, the viewers. Alia is already in Kashmir for work when she's thinking of Rocky, instead of them suddenly breaking out into a song in the snow. Did you struggle with designing the Bollywood dream sequence in 2023? Karen has also given a slight tribute to Aditya Chopra from Hogaya Haituko To Pyar Sena, from Dolwail Delaney Alu Jayanj, where Kajal and Shah Rukh realize they've parted ways but fallen in love. This is suspension of disbelief. Karen didn't have a doubt whether it'd work or not. He was driven utterly by conviction. The only challenge was to make Runveer do this. He's not done this lip sync song, except for one with Priyanka Chopra and Gundi. Otherwise he's never done a love song where he's looking all dreamy and looking at the heroine with dove eyes. I wanted to do an exercise of rehearsals with him. Stay tuned for exclusive footage and behind the scenes of their upcoming movie.